All right, so in this nice sunny day, I just wanted to talk about the Outdoor Master gear that they sent me and uh, they do not pay me to make this video. So everything I will say is just my opinion and uh, you know, uh, it's great because they sent me all this stuff, but uh, I'm gonna be completely honest with you guys. So we're gonna talk about my helmet, the goggles and some extra gear that they sent me. So first of all, they sent me the gear even before the season started. Emmet and goggles have been with me the whole season. This is the more IN helmet they have. It's the Outdoor Master Diamond MIPS helmet, which has integrated MIPS systems, which is basically low friction layer, uh, which will reduce rotational forces to the head if you crash, which is always a great thing to have uh, more safety features you never have enough safety features so that's a great plus and uh, overall the aesthetics you know that's really up to you if you like them or not i really like this helmet i really like it i think it's looking really good even uh, and i'm i'm really boring i just every time they they ask me to choose a color for something they want to send me I'm like i'm gonna take the black so everything they sent me is basically black plane, really basic, uh, which I like, but you know, you, there are plenty of colors. So if you're not into the black vibe, you can go white or the other colors, I believe. And it's really comfortable. I can wear it all day without any problems. So that's a big plus, there's vent holes. So if you're sweaty like me, just open the vent holes, you're gonna be a little bit more fresh. The ear pads are really great. The strap is not bothering me at all. You can adjust the size on the back. I can't recommend it enough. It's comfortable, it's safe and it's not really expensive. So yeah. Moving on, we have the all goggle compartment which is I think the thing they are most famous for. This right here is the first pair of goggles they sent me. It's the Pro goggle. I think they look really nice, uh, but I'm more into like cylindrical goggles. These are just spherical, so they don't look bad, don't get me wrong, but these have the orange lens, so it's great for sunny days or even like more cloudy days. These lens are magnetic, so you can just swap them out. The lens quality is really high. And uh, for this price, you can't really get anything better, I believe. These are double layer lens, so no fog uh, inside when it's maybe cold and you're sweating a lot, there will be no fog. You get really a lot of value out of it, so it's nice overall. That's all the other master goggles I tried. They have this really sharp uh, lens and they are all double layered, so it's really nice to see through them. We will talk about now the Falcon goggles, which is my favorite goggles of all time, right? These are awesome. These, besides looking awesome, these are really comfortable, right? They fit nicely with the helmet and like the design in general, I love it, I love it. It's really minimal, nothing too excessive, so you have the small logo right here and the Zeiss, because these are made by Zeiss. These are really high quality lenses. Uh, these ones are the probably the darkest they make. For a sunny day like this, it's perfect, it's awesome. My eyes don't get tired, I can wear this all day long. I can see everything uh, sharply and nicely. And uh, yeah, just a really high quality goggle for again, a uh, reasonable price, right? This goggle also come with an extra lens, which I will show now. So in this case, I got the black lens as a main lens, and then I got the yellow lens is a secondary lens and again this is a really high quality lens so 
like now it's way too bright to keep this one but it's really high quality and I use it all the time that whether it's like foggy or snowy I can see really well with this goggle um, it's probably the best lens I, I can think of for bad weather so and you know it's nice to have something that you can really rely on right the magnetic mount uh, some people say it will fail when you crash and I crashed like thousands of times this season it only failed one because I hit my knee on my face otherwise you put them on they stay on right oh another thing is uh, they come with really great packaging right um, all the lenses come with this carrying case and the pouch itself which is not only great for keeping them scratch free in your bag but it's also just great for cleaning them so highly highly recommend outdoor master products so really nice art case really great for covering now we're gonna go through this lens which is actually the the most expensive lens they make right this is the uh, same series like it's same uh, falcon frame so as long as frame goes nothing really changes uh, this one is a different color because they pick the color for me otherwise I just take the black one again so yeah I'm really boring uh, but this one is really great because I don't know if you can see it has a little like solar panel on top and when it gets less light it will become clear as soon as the light hits it will become darker so being the same frame I can just take this lens out and put this one on and let me just do a quick test right now yeah, this one is maybe a slightly bright, uh, brighter right this this one with the variable wheel T is slightly brighter at this darkest point so this one will still be better but a slightly bit but if I wear this and I have really sensible eyes so if I wear this I got no problems keeping my eyes on right if I just take it out I can't really keep my eyes on because I really I have really sensible eyes right so I always use it when it's like sunny and there are clouds around that you don't know what, what you're going to expect or maybe it's on some side of the piece it's sunny then it's cloudy it just changes instantly so if you're skiing down say it's really sunny and you get in a shady area this thing will turn clear and you can see it really well then you turn back you go back to the sun and it suddenly goes back to dark lens so if you want one lens only one lens you don't want to swap them maybe during the day this one is the one to go for it's a bit more expensive but you get two in one and you don't have to change them right so now we're gonna go through some extra gear that they sent me just to let you know what i think about it so the first one you can already see is this hoodie it's it's really comfortable there's a nice padding inside it will keep you warm but at the same time it's like uh, really water resistant so you can see I'm not getting wet the snow is just going off right so even if you crash it, it will keep you dry right I never wore like a normal hoodie to go skiing because I thought it was just stupid if you crash you're gonna be wet for the whole day that's I don't really like that this one sure I will use it all day long and it also has a ski pass pocket so you can just fit your pass here and it makes it really easy to go through the gate uh, I like the design it's really really minimal um, it, it fits my vibe right this one is another product that uh, it's really been with me the whole season since I own it since they shipped it to me and this one doesn't even ship uh, in Europe I believe like at the time I had to to get it shipped from the US to me and it costed more than the product itself so if you have the chance to buy this thing just buy it man 
if you live in the US, this is an absolute banger. So what this is, is just a pair of headphones, which goes directly into your earpads. So let me just show you. I hope you can see this. But this earpad has a little Velcro inside of it, which you can put your headphones on inside, like this, right? Then you can just close it. We will do the same thing on the other side. Then I just usually just tuck it back here. And it's done, right? You put your helmet on and you have music in your ears, like that. Right now they are closed, but let me just open them. Right, so they pair up really fast. I don't know if you can see this, but they are basically fully charged. And uh, I charged them once in this season. Today it was saying low battery. So basically three months later that I charged them, uh, they said low battery. I charged them like... Uh, 20 minutes, maybe a little bit less, and they are basically fully charged. So the battery lasts so much, you basically don't have to worry about them. So I just charged them twice this whole season, uh, which is pretty insane because I really use them a lot. And uh, you clearly can't hear it now, but I, the quality of the audio is great, right? I also had the Apple AirPods, but that, those things were just in my ears. These ones are really comfortable, you can just forget they are there. The quality is great, price is great, these are the best thing ever. Especially if you ski alone like me, I just listen to music. And they are really easy to control through the buttons they have. So you have a big button right here, which is, you can play and pause. Then you have up and down volume and you can skip track. So you can do everything with your gloves on. So if you want to check any of this gear out, I will leave links in the description to basically everything. So again, I want to thank Outdoor Master for sending all this gear out. And uh, if they're watching this video, which I hope they do, but uh, thanks for all this gear. I really appreciate it. Yeah, that's it for it, for this video, right? Thanks for joining me. And uh, if you want to check any of the gear, link in the description.